This is the first look inside the Hinkler shopping centre after floodwaters surged into the building. Today there was a fluoro army as shop owners and tradesmen got down to work. All 85 shops in the centre were impacted as the muddy water rose up through the underground car park. Water at, at various levels, um, more so down the Woolworths end, um, about 400 mils and, and then up towards Coles and Kmart, about 100 mils of water. Most shops have been stripped bare. In some, piles of ruined stock still sit in the middle of the store. Woolworths has been completely closed up. It was the hardest hit. Putrid and, uh, and very thick mud. Manager Robert Campbell and his staff have been sent to other stores, in particular Sugarland, which is now receiving three times the number of customers, with all other major supermarkets in the area damaged. We had a few days where it was a bit, of, a bit hectic in those first couple of days when everybody was coming in. But Woolworths has said it will rebuild at Hinkler. Their company's um, planning to spend about $5 billion to, $5 million to, to redo the store up. At Accessory Store Diva, staff were today packing up what was left of their shop. Everyone's been really supportive of each other within the centre especially. Everyone's helping each other out with whatever they can do. It'll be a long road to recovery. The centre is still running off generators with power not likely to be switched on until next week. Suffice to say, you know, there'll be millions of dollars of damage here, um, but uh, a figure at this stage is just too, too early to determine. The owners say they'll work quickly, but a reopening won't be till at least April. Pippa Bradshaw, 7 News.